Hey guys, Sapphire. I am going to be streaming Life is Strange True Colors. I'm super excited to be back. Super excited to play. I have no idea what this game is going to be like. I've never played before. All I know is that the superpower is empathy. I have no idea, no idea what the fuck that even means. Um, this is an 18 plus stream, so miners, fuck off. Okay, let's get into it. here. You've been at the Helping Hands group home for eight years. We've been through a lot in that time. We have. Okay. And now you're finally leaving to live with your brother. My brother Gabe. It says here he lives in Haven Springs, Colorado. Is that correct? That's a big move. Do you have any plans as far as school or a job? My brother said I might pick up a few shifts at the bar he works at. So you'd be dealing with people. I love her outfit. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe, bro. That is a crazy Does answer. Does your brother know about your issues? What kind is of doctor is this? Can I get question, Dr. Lynn? Alex, you know that I care about you. With everything that has happened. She seems so awkward. The doctor and like you. Alex. I kind of feel bad for her. He doesn't know. No one will once I leave this place. I'll just be a normal person. Okay. The background is time. interesting. It's all angry. I love it. Life is strange, true colors. You yeah, know, I'm actually really excited about this game. Like, I played the first Life is Strange and I loved it. Like, Max was Bay. It was a great game. Um, I played the second one, it was pretty cool, so I'm like super excited about this one, but empathy versus, you know, being able to rewind time, that's a really big shift. Okay. Gabe said to meet him at the bridge. I can't wait to see him. Okay, so, how do these controls work? Gabe told me to meet him at the bridge. Okay, so I can't just explore how I want. How unfortunate. Oh, damn. Just let me live. Can I go down the hill? Is this Gabe? Maybe? No, okay. Can't go there. Well, I'm on the bridge. So this is actually really pretty. It looks like a fairy bridge. Like, look at that view. I want to live there. Like, holy fuck. It's time to pack up and move. Okay. I feel like this is low-key like channeling cottage core or some shit. 
and I like it. It's him, girl. I feel like she's not a hugger, though. Oh. What's the protocol for reuniting with your long lost sister after eight years? Uh, hug or handshake? Going for a hug. I'm cool with the hug if you are. <laughs> oh, he's crushing my ribs. Still part of the protocol. <laughs> okay, what's wrong with a hug, though? Like, I feel like that's cool. So good to see you again. I can't believe you're here. Believe it. Ooh, he's blue. Why is he glowing blue? She saw her on that. I missed it. Okay. I kind of uh, think I like this power. Uh, uh. Yeah. Time will do that to you. But I feel like Are you ready to see the town? her power is invasive. Um, X or B, X or B. Let's do it or be nervous. Let's do it. Hell yeah, let's rock and roll. I don't know why I said that. Me neither. <laughs> but I love the enthusiasm. Oh gosh, I love it. Okay, the uh, Black Lantern is just up the street. I mentioned I live above the bar, right? Even better. Bro. That's the trip. You must be white. I'm good. The drive through the mountains was amazing. Um, Eleanor, hey, Alice just got here. I am loving Alice, this vibe. Meet Eleanor Late, owner of the flower shop, and honest to God, royalty of Haven Springs. Oh, it is so nice to finally meet you. Welcome. So many huggers, though. Oh. What the hell? What color is she gonna turn? I'm so glad to have you, Alex. Gabe told us all about you. I'm glad to be here. I bet she's red. No, I want to see her color. Fuck. Now I'm she sad. Nice. Yeah, she's great. <laughs> Piss. A little quick on the draw with hugs, though. Yeah, no shit. I want more colors. Welcome to Haven. Okay. Rocky Mountain Record Traders. Okay. Uh, Bailey skin bike. Giant ram. Okay. This is truly a mountain town. The silver dragon. That sounds like a bookshop. I feel like it's not, but it would be cool if it was. Uh, brown bear diner. It's nice. It what? is nice. It's quaint as shit. I want to live here. Is this the first official stop on the tour? Absolutely. If you follow me inside, you'll find a prize exhibit. Gabe Chen buys makeup flowers for angry girlfriend. Oh, I can't wait. It's oh got some sort of reviews. <laughs> um, went out. Hey, Gabe. Riley, meet my sister, Alex. What's your greatest weakness? Uh, what kind of question what? is that? for a college interview. We've been debating this one for days. Gabe insists that I give an honest answer. It's always better to give an honest answer. Be honest or not? Nah. What's the alternative? Lying? Not lying. More like strategic half-truthing. I feel like strategic like, strategic half-truthing is definitely harder. the answer. I saved too many puppies. They could smell that bullshit a mile away. I've been trying to warn her. Oh, yeah? What would you do? Be clever. Always be clever. Telling the truth only gets you so far. Oh, you hear that, Gabe? You're outnumbered. But it just depends on how clever you can be. He'll come around eventually. Alex, help me out real quick. What do I get for Charlotte? Sunflowers are her favorite. Sunflowers. But I've read online that Lily of the Valley is great for saying sorry. What do you think? Sunflowers. Uh, actually, what did you do? What, uh, exactly are you apologizing for? This time around? Maybe the toilet seat? <laughs> okay. Go for sunflowers. They're her favorite. 
If Charlotte loves sunflowers, go with the sunflowers. That's what I was thinking. Like, if you're giving me flowers, at least get me my favorite flower. You know, if Mac brought me flowers half as often, well, he wouldn't be Mac. Is it still on and off with you two? Sort of. More on right now, but wait five minutes, mask again. Put this on my tab? You sure you don't want to just tell Mac about the interview? No, not yet. I'll okay. Why do you have a tab for flowers, though? Why not just pay for them? We can leave when you're ready. Sounds good. And why is she not telling her boyfriend well about college? We That's weird. Okay. Um, let's look at these. How to kill everything you touch. A flower book by Alex Chen. <laughs> How to kill everything you touch. I must have read that book because I most definitely can't keep any flowers alive. The perfect flower bed. Making the magic garden real. Yeah, okay. Does anyone actually sit in the decorative store chair? Let's see. Statuette. It's mandatory for any enchanted garden. It's cute though. Um. You can make anything pretty if you shove a bouquet inside. That is so not true. Let's see. Perfect. Nomeo officially looks cool. That guy's bad to the gnome. Right? I heard he won the Nobel Peace Prize. Oh god, please stop. Oh god, it's so funny. No problem. <laughs> Deceased. I love it. Um, what else can I do? Birdhouses. House is really taking off. Can I go anywhere else? What's this photo? Aw, I wonder who they are. The world Cute, may right? never know. Yeah. Are those your grandparents? No, but they were like family. Let's Alistair see. and Ava Murphy. Nana bought the building from them before I was born. Okay. I guess that's basically everything. Um, Hopefully my advice doesn't derail her entire life. I'm sure it's fine. Totally will. That's fine, though. Uh, I don't care about anything else. We can leave. Right? Yeah. I hope Charlotte likes the sunflowers. I don't think I missed anything. Here. Leave. That's fine. Ready. Thanks. See you soon, Dry. to next. How long have you and Charlotte been dating? Oof, I didn't like that sound. About three years now, I think. You must spend a lot of money on bouquets. <laughs> She's worth it. He must get in a lot of trouble. Yoga. Just, wow. Why would anyone in their right mind do that? Just no. No, no, no. Uh, what the shit is goat yoga? Yoga. With goats. More like crazy. But okay. Welcome to Colorado. Yeah, how about now? Gabe Chen. Flower delivery man. I know, right? Let me duck in here and smooth everything out. It'll only be a minute. I'll introduce you properly later. <laughs> Once, you know. He's it's afraid no of her really. meeting his girlfriend. Okay. That's funny. It's gonna be longer than a minute. Trust me. Oh. Hi there. 
Gabe's your brother, right? I'm Ethan. Charlotte's my mom. Hi, Ethan. I'm Alex. What oh. you reading? She has a brat. Named Warden. Okay. Oh, has she found the scepter of serenity yet? She's looking for the scepter, but I think she'll need the bangle of vanishing to get to it. Firing or vanishing is my kind of power. Fire. That's that's a no-brainer. I'd rather shoot fire from my hand. Burn all my enemies to a crisp. What if you're high-fiving a friend and the fire ring goes off? Risky. <laughs> well, I guess all my friends need, you, you know, comics, fire safety classes. Show you the one I'm making. I'd love to see it. That kid was ready. Holy crap. You can keep it if you want. I made a bunch of copies just all in the record store. This is awesome, Ethan. I can't wait to read it. That's a solid looking comic. Are you going camping? You know the mines? Oh no. They exist. There are a bunch of old tunnels all around the mountains. This doesn't sound good. I think I found a way into one. Kid, no. I mean, no, 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 I'm no, no, no. I'm expert on old mines, but that would scare the crap out of me. I just like to explore sometimes. It's no big deal. Oh, man. I shouldn't have told you that. Be careful, kid. I know we just met, but be careful out there, okay? You don't need to worry. Really. Why do kids want to go explore, like, old mines? That just sounds nice you, not fun. Okay, where to next? Okay, this place looks really cool. Like, hella cool. I want to be here. Like, the music, this the instruments. This reminds me of the shop Gabe and I used to go to. <laughs> the pictures. He'd save up for weeks from his shitty car wash job just to buy us something to listen to. It's crazy. Here I am, years later. Still waiting for my big brother in the record store. Except this time, I'm buying the record. Okay. Um. No way. This is cool. I smell romance. Oh, uh. Unicorn or zombie parade? Unicorn. Wednesday with Bomb Squad. Up next, a very special request from some chick. Some chick, okay. That's my official name. Sorry, the store's actually closed right now. Which is confusing because it's obviously open. Wait, are you Alex? That's me. Wow. Gabe's been talking about you coming since... So everybody knows her. I guess that's what it's like in a small town. Ryan. At least that's not another hugger. Nice Thank God. So, all the way from Portland, huh? What do you think of Haven? 
still deciding cool so far based off of this record place i'm just gonna say it's fucking cool i've seen some cool things so far like this record store is amazing. oh my god the cat it's official it's just really fucking cool black cat like just like my story. baby okay yep it's a cultural landmark for sure so the store is closed but they opened it just for you you must be picking up something pretty important. Yeah, well, you could say that. An outdoorsman's guide to the calls of common birds. Common birds. What kind of name is that? Oh, that's... Different or nerdy? Nah, that's nerdy as shit, bro. The nerdiest thing I've ever seen. And I owned two Schoolhouse Rock albums. I'd lie and say it was for my work, but... You know, that's just no, nerdy as shit. It's totally for fun. <laughs> so, you're a... Colorado State Park Ranger. It's all coming into focus. Bruh. Well, bummer the store's closed. I was thinking of getting a gift for Gabe, but I'll figure something else out. I don't even know if he still listens to records. He does. Charlotte just got him a record player for his birthday. Does everybody know everything in this small town? I'm pretty sure. Put something on hold. I'm very curious so what he listens don't to. Work here? Step one. Be the easiest sale she's ever made. If I could just find the whole list. Bro. Is he just casually looks around a store that's not his, apparently? Yeah. What the hell is this? Before. Wanna help me look? <laughs> oh yeah. What is this? Okay. Any ideas on where to start? Just go on through a store. Okay. No idea. Sometimes. Leave stuff all over the place. Um I'm gonna look this at This place has just the right amount of doors. Action figures. Um I feel like why wouldn't it be you know on the computer? But uh, Gabe's record is in here. But which one is it? Oh my gosh. Um, is it wrong that the note makes me want to touch it more? Oh yeah, no, I would definitely touch it. Uh, fuck. Let's see sheet music. It's been so long since I've played. Even I used to dream about cutting demos no, all the time. Not over kids. here. Never in these troubling times, the world could really use more rock songs with clarinet. So how do I get a rich Polish clarinetist to buy me things? Nope. Where could it be? Search. I'm detecting an indie. Okay. Uh, color me impressed. Ooh. Okay, that's cool. I like it. Uh, let's look at the How bulletin board. Small town. I see do everything but what I'm supposed to be doing right now. I wonder if there's an actual time limit. That'll be bad. Uh, I'll stop though. Okay. Um. Ninth Warden. Hero of the intergalactic peace wars and friend to lonely children everywhere. That's interesting. Let's see. There's a cat. Wait. Is that the hold list? Is it really under the cat? Okay. Move the kitty. Don't freak out. Just gonna. Okay, just kidding. Okay, bad kitty. You got out of there with both your hands. Thing is, She's sitting on the hold list. We could use her toy to lure her away. If we can find her. <laughs> Give me a hand. Okay, so... 
Maybe Valkyrie, Valkyrie will move with food. Okay. I like Valkyrie, but my cat's name is Morrigan, and I feel like Morrigan is just a little bit better. Just, just a little bit. Um. Huh. Colorado digs its alt rock. I see. Let's see. Any luck finding that cat toy? Not yet. So, what's the prediction? What do you think Gabe listens to these days? Banjo dubstep. Acapella screamo. Uh, acapella screamo. Why not? I think Gabe's gotten so emo that he doesn't like instruments anymore. Just dudes screaming and crying into the microphone. Dear God. Let's hope not. <laughs> well, there's only one way to find out. Let's see if we can find that cat toy. Bro. Why can't we trick the cat with food? Search Looks the like box. a toy could live here. What if he exclusively listens to Smash Mouth? Wait for it. Cover bands. Ugh. I disown him. <laughs> okay. Is it in the box? Damn. It is not in the box. Um... Maybe that drawer? Alright, what about the drawer? It could be Celine Dion's greatest hits. Greatest hits are great, though. You mean the essential Celine Dion? She is a Canadian treasure. Alright, what next? Nothing. Okay. Junk box. Maybe in the junk box. That looks like a toy. It looks very catty. And we have a winner. Oh yeah. Third yes. time's a charm. <laughs> Be safe out there. If I die a horrible cat related death, tell Gabe I'm sorry. Okay. Now, here, kitty kitty. <laughs> Who's the superior mammal now? I don't know about superior. Like, not at all. All right. <laughs> Good idea. Thanks. For a guy who lives in the woods, I'm pretty good at this customer service thing. Customer service is great. Uh, what did he get? Tiny blue bot. Okay. And then King of Leon. Okay. That's actually pretty great. Should have known. Wait. Seriously? Gabe and I used to listen to records together all the time. We'd forget about the world and rock out for hours. You gotta tell me what Gabe was like as a kid. Any ammunition you can give me? Oh my gosh. So, lie or be truthful? Who's a dork or a badass? But I feel like for like a little sister, dude was probably a badass. Low key. But now I'm gonna say he was a dork. <laughs> he acted cool, but he was really a big dork. Like, one time, he was pretending to stage dive and fell off the bed, sprained an ankle. It was funny. <laughs> Bro, she's a horrible, the big, stupid little sister. The game changer in the Gabe embarrassing department. All right, you're looking at 20 even. Ooh, no, she is no very way. red. I can't believe you're doing this no. again. Come on. Do you have any idea how much time I put into this? Very, very red. You just... No, dude. I can't come over there. I'm working. Interesting how her powers work. It's called a job. Maybe you'd understand if you ever had... I can watch the boost if you gotta get out of here. Hold, hold on a sec. Are you serious? 
Awesome. You have a playlist, right? That's that. interesting. I like it. Oh, no bird calls, though. I'll be there. One sec. Huh. I think I like it. That is major I empathy. Okay. Uh, never better or better now. Just be honest, better now. Sorry. I was just a little thrown for a moment. Thanks. You got it. The fact that you noticed though is interesting. I feel like some people definitely would not have noticed Somehow that. I knew I'd find you in here. Things went well with Charlotte? And he's keeping her little surprise from him? Dude is sweet AF. Talk about Speaking a good friend. Of, my two favorite people in my favorite place. What have you guys been up to? Talking about birds, checking out that place. Uh talking about birds. You know, talking about bird calls and bird call related media. This guy really loves his birds. Guilty. I feel like he you know, does not believe that. In Haven, right? <laughs> anyway, wow. I'm glad you two met. Not only is this dude my best friend, he's the best guide to Haven you could ever find. And this dude hands me the best beers? Bro. <laughs> I feel like if this ain't friends, I don't know what is. Mac was in here earlier, and uh, he really That's great. I love it. Who knows where to find me? Anyway, my shift starts in 20. Ready to go? Take along? All right. Tell I'll catch up. I got a radio show to host. <laughs> okay, this is cool. I like it. Like, I think it's great when you can have friends like that that got your back. Okay, where are you next? I should check in. Do you mind? No, yeah, of course. Okay. What up, Monster Slayer Thanor? Hey! One week to the LARP, you stoked? This is so cute! Hell yeah! Attaboy. Oh, we gotta talk road trips next. It's a long drive to Denver. Are we driving a step? We'll see. She's a GM, so she's got to be in Denver pretty early. What are you doing tonight? Mom says I'm supposed to stay at the Lantern until she gets off work. But I kind of want to hang out at home. Is that okay? Do you, man. <laughs> but I'm going to check that homework later tonight, though. Better be done, Capiche. Capiche, good to meet you. Bro. Yeah, same. See you around. So weird seeing you do the dad thing. This the kid is a low-key no, no, menace. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. No, no, I'm better than a dad. I'm like dad plus. <laughs> dad plus, <laughs> bro. No. We trust each other. He tells me stuff he doesn't even tell Shar. Oof. Ethan didn't tell Gabe about going to explore the old mine. He's about he to get his bubble burst. Should I? Or should I blow his cover? Uh, tell Gabe, keep Ethan's secret. Um, I feel like she should tell Gabe, honestly. Um, uh, because I feel like otherwise this kid is gonna get hurt. Um, tell Gabe. Yes. Uh, I should probably tell you something. Shoot. Earlier, when Ethan and I were talking, he met. Oof. That was weird. Continue. Mentioned exploring some old mine. Oh, man. He seemed like he knew what he was doing, but I thought you'd want to know. <laughs> this fucking kid. I'm going to tell Charlotte. Just give me a second. Ooh. Ooh, Ethan's in trouble. Really? We'll see. I appreciate you telling me. I feel bad for the kid, but like. You did the right thing. 
Ugh. What do you say we get you settled in? Being the adult in the situation kind of sucks. But letting a brat go, like, explore mines by themselves is, like, a hard no. So, this is what a mining town looks like. Thought there'd be more guys in overalls running around. With soot all over their faces? Exactly. Okay, um... What do they mine here, though? Used to be silver. Back oh my in the day. god, I love these and statues. Now, uranium. Like, look at them. They blow these big holes in the mountains and sell it off to nuclear power plants. Uranium. Oh. Yeah. We'll actually be able to hear a blast later tonight. It's pretty intense. Isn't that Sounds like, like bad for the environment? Jed. Hey, got someone I want you to meet. Alex, this is my buddy Jed. Buddy hell, will you listen to this horse shit? His bossy means. You on the Black Lantern. For the last 12 years or so. It's good to meet you, Alex. Heard a hell of a lot about you. Oh? Only bad stuff. Mostly lies. Bro. Your brother's full of shit. You know that? <laughs> he just about wet himself waiting for you to get here. <laughs> this is great. I love watching this interaction. Um, just about or same. Uh, you're not same. I was excited to see him too. Guess we're an almost wet yourself kind of family. Ha! I like her. Yeah, she's okay, I guess. We're heading in. You coming? Uh, in a minute. Supposed to meet Eleanor to talk spring festival decorations. He tell you about the festival yet? Not in detail. Festival. I like festivals. Later. You do not want to get this guy started. I'm loquacious, goddammit. It's charming. Loquacious. I like it. Oh, before you leave. Word of warning. Max got that old bug up his ass again. So I've heard. Yeah. So, just, you know, eyes open. Anyway, you guys go settle. Alex, pleasure. I'll mind, Jed. Okay. What next? I'm excited. So, spring festival equals mountain prom. It's a lot cooler than it sounds. Not possible. I'm picturing some straight up Wicker Man shit. Okay, You've so. Been before. What's wrong with Wicker Man shit? Like, that just looks fun as shit. Dude's a gentleman and shit? I love it. Is this the room I have? What kind of country nonsense is this? Shit, man. Oh wait, is this the whole apartment? This is all yours? Don't sound so surprised. This is just a straight up man cave. Bro. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. I feel like it's not bad for a bachelor. Not for a bachelor plus his little sister. But it's nice. It's really nice. When you said that you had a nice place, I was picturing small but homey. Well then. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> Seriously, this is great. And the best part is, it's actually yours. I'm mostly staying at Charlotte's now. Uh, what do you mean it's mine or I love it? Uh, what do you mean? What exactly do you mean, this is mine? It's this thing where people have places they live. Bro. We call them homes. That sass, okay. I, mean, I want you to have a fresh start here. So I get a man cave. Cave. I Okay. Thank you. You got it. Just promise me you don't build too many keggers at Ennin's surprise fires. 
And Jed will kill me if that happens again. Again? <laughs> Bro, I love it. The sibling humor is great. Didn't we already do the whole staring at me thing? It's just... You look a lot like how I imagine you'd be. How do you imagine somebody yeah. will be, bro? That's weird. Do I look how you expected? You're still you. Didn't expect the beard. Uh, I'm gonna mess with the beard. I honestly didn't expect you to have a beard. Well, they didn't tell you? When you move to Colorado, you automatically get an amazing beard, a pretentious knowledge of craft beers, and a Subaru. Okay, now, I mean, don't hate on Subarus. I didn't get any of those things. Subarus are don't great. Worry, I will stop at nothing to get you your very but own color. The audacity. <laughs> Good, because I actually got you something. Wait, what? Surprise. Wait, is this? This is the album I requested. I know, I'm good. I was gonna get this for you. Well, I got it for you first, so I get the credit. <laughs> That's actually really funny. Uh, crazy stickle. Ooh, I want that on my wall. Like, I really love this game. Like, I love the sibling no, interaction. This. Like, this is great. Feels just like old times. Oh, no. But, like, I know this game. Stop that. So, somewhere, yeah. there's gonna late. be something <laughs> fucked up. And I'm not, I'm not ready for it. I don't know if my heart can fucking handle it. You know, what the fuck even is that? What like. even is that? You're way off tempo. <laughs> yeah, dude, no. That is... Mm -mm. You just gotta let the beat flow through you. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, no. Dude, no. I can't. Is he gonna break it? Okay, no. Thank God. I can't. Your turn. That's all you. Here's how it done. No. I, I gotta outdo him. Fine. Oh my gosh. This is extra as shit and I love it. Rock off? Hell yeah. <laughs> Hold up, wait. He lives above a bar though, so I feel like she should chill a little bit with like the stomping and shit, but this is still kind of great. You haven't lost a beat. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Just give me a sec. Knew it. Yeah. Hey, Mac. Can I help you? Something's wrong. I read Riley's phone. I know you've been meeting with her behind my back. Ooh. That's not what you think, Mac. I knew some fucked up shit was about to happen. Because I thought you were fucking my girlfriend. Dude, I promise you've got it all wrong. Tell me why I shouldn't kick your ass. Uh, right now. No. No, 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 no. Dude is no, really, really angry. Not, here. not my place, man. I really need to talk to your girlfriend. I'm talking to you. Oh, fuck. Oh my gosh, uh, this is not going well. Um, Stay. Stay. bro. The fuck. Oh. The fuck. I'm upset he's not kicking his ass, but, um, like, dude is about to get fucked up and it's great, but, like, oof. 
he started that shit, so I'm like, damn. about rage but um you deserve that so whatever you know he deserves that fucking beat down this is just fucking psycho Says the dude that was kicking the shit out of that man you can both go fuck yourselves i'm so sorry don't worry about it Oof. Fuck. Bruise knuckles. Okay. Bitch hawked out majorly. Wait, game. Alex. It's fine. I gotta go stop my shift. I feel like he's lucky he doesn't have a black eye. Though maybe the Mac dude will learn not to, you know, assume shit. So wait, I hope they don't get kicked out though, because that would be bad. I'm okay. Though, so, I guess major empathy would be bad in like a situation like this. I'm okay. I'm okay. Hmm. So yeah, that's a major con. Like, what would be a positive to having, like, major empathy? I guess I might as well unpack. Like, I don't even know. Like, I don't even fucking know, honestly. Alex. Do I want to know? Uh, yes, because I'm a nosy bitch. Guess I kinda gave Gabe the runaround, huh? Um, Anita and Eduardo. They were one of the good ones. Read it. Chico Chen from Anita Morales. Looking for my sister, Helen and Gabe. Eduardo and I were very happy to hear from you. We are glad to see you are doing so well after all these years. Colorado is very far away. Sadly, it was difficult to keep talking with Alex after she was taken into the system. We don't know where she lives now. This is phone number for the agency. Maybe they can help. Wow. Gabe's been looking for me for a while. Okay. Wow. Okay. Dude is really trying. Uh, look at the letter. So Gabe and Riley have been working on her interview, and Mac thought they were sleeping together. This is fucking stupid. Okay. So Colorado Institute of Tech. But it's also like, <laughs> I feel like Gabe and Riley like set themselves up though. Like, she should have honestly been honest about what she was doing. And then maybe her fucking crazy boyfriend wouldn't think she was fucking somebody. Especially if they were on and getting off again, and she knew he had an anger problem. So your application has been reviewed. We're pleased to inform you that you've been selected to move forward. Cool. So yeah, no. Uh, I feel like they fucked themselves, Loki. Broadcasting straight from your local record store. 
Because how fucking cool is that? At least I held this photo together in front of Ryan and Steph. Whoa. Looks like Ryan turned my brother into a model citizen. The cool picture. What Gabe books? crushing up on comics and art. Really going the extra mile for Ethan and Charlotte. That is actually pretty cool. Another Wait, photo. what? Is that a real live dead deer? He's gonna hunt and sue. Okay. Video Must games. be Ethan's. <laughs> Dino Racer too. Gabe's been forced to play. Comics. Huh. They've really changed the art style since I read these. Turntable. There's a whole fucking sword. sword. Okay. Really happy the fucking crazy man didn't see the whole fucking sword over there. Um, Gabe always wanted a bike like this. There's a whole crack in the wall. I the drywall crack when I see one. Uh, postcard. Greetings from Mexico. Okay, sure. looks like he fits right in. Oh man. Gabe used to crush me. Okay. Jerk. I think I've basically looked at everything. I like to fucking explore everything. No way. Gabe has this photo too? Look at our parents. Mom's healthy. Dad's only kind of an asshole all right open all right unpack oh god shoo shoo's gonna look so grungy on this nice bed that's cute shoo shoo me through some hard times but i, I was hoping <laughs> what kind of name of that it it's adorable, though. I can't even hate. Oof, that kid is gonna be so really upset. Talented. The tunnel to the monster stronghold of Delmon is collapsed. I have to find another way in. I'm gonna find the way to the guard. Long dead from the looks of it. Blood. This is actually really cool. Like, I love the detail. Okay. Not like a ton of letters. How much we've changed. I think it's nice that they both have that same picture, though. even her fault though like it's not like her brother was doing much to get dude off of him so like I feel like that shit was warranted all right knock anger it all started with a knock I think I felt something off before Gabe even opened the door like something was slipping under the frame something red something raw then there's Mac and that familiar feeling of dread that always comes when I know I'm losing control no matter how hard I fight it, it just keeps coming until my blood is a running boil. Then the part where my whole body has already made the choice to hurt someone. It's gonna happen and no one can make me stop. 
Max Anger felt hot and dizzy and also a little bit afraid. Really, it was all about Riley. Red. Rage. Relief. The thought of her with someone else. The thought of her with anyone else. It was under his skin, burning. That feeling like hot cords grinding around behind your ribs. It's one of the most exhausting feelings in the world. It's such a relief when it's over. When your ears stop ringing and your heart slows down from humming to a lazy jackhammer. It's such a relief. Too bad it costs Gabe a punch in the mouth. How do you apologize for something like that? Um, these threads that bind us up, they burn and weave. See. Inside my ribs, they hurt until you leave. Seethe, breathe, cleave. Isabel English. I tried to write this so many times, and they all end up in the trash. Let's see how far I can get. I really liked Isabel. She's sweet and loved her paint. She smuggled in a few beers for us on weekends. But her depression was brutal. It crept under my fingernails and made my eyelids feel like stone. I had to focus just to keep breathing, like dripping a ribcage in lead. It was hard to get away from. Eventually, I got too much. She battles the sedatives, lying in vomit, her eyes open and glassy and afraid. I'm sorry, Isabel. I thought we could have stayed friends when we finally got out of this vanilla-flavored holding pen. I wish you could have stuck around for a little longer. If I ever see you again, I'll bring the beer. Okay. I like the journal entries. Like, I love how they're all, like, different. It's cool. Tessa anger. Bitter and jealous and a little queasy. That's what the anger tasted like. Didn't even have time to step back. Seconds later, I was rushing across the room. What a mess. I split her lip open. Poor thing. I wonder how long it'll take to heal. It's hard to clean blood off your clothes. Makes you feel wrong. I don't really blame her for being upset. She thinks I get special treatment at the home. But I don't. Does it matter now? She keeps herself. Most of the other kids do, actually. So that'll be business as usual until a new group comes in. And it starts all over again. The worst part? They confiscated my fucking guitar. Two week ban. At least I get it back. I promise, I promise. It's not what you say. No favors, no secrets, none coming my way. And after all this, you still had to pay. Okay. Memories, journal, this mess. My block. <laughs> my block instead of my, uh, my space. Okay. Um, the hell? Okay. Calling volunteers to help with this year's spring festival. The sign up sheet is on east side of Lee Flowers. We need to see. Those are still needed. Other volunteers must put together a never great festival. Alright, it's coming along. Special thanks to Diane. Okay. Mike, enough with all the transplants moving here. I don't care if it's good for the economy. I must haven the way it used to be. Oh, okay. I'm gonna choose to believe this isn't about me. It'd be fine if any of them knew how to drive, especially in the snow or at night. <laughs> Say Mike, if I remember right, you yourself came out of here from Jersey just a couple years ago. Yeah, and look how downhill everything's gone since then. That's great. Gabe, free drinks tonight at the Blank Lantern. Celebrate my sister's I can arrival. See why Gabe fits in so well here. They're certainly not. Friend Alex is great. Uh, Tyson Mining. Danger Stone. Oof. So probably a very good thing she told. About the brat going to the mine. My sister Alex is finally getting into town. Town hall will be fielding questions. The latest issue of Legendary Monster Hunter Thanor is out. Ugh. 
replenish this later. Hmm. What's under the bed? A guitar. Oh, a very pretty guitar. Oh, Alex, here's a little something. No fucking way. Welcome home. Can't wait to hear you shred. Well, she has an awesome fucking big brother. I feel like she's gonna cry. Which is actually kind of adorable. I think all of the pro tags from Life is Strange have been like some type of artistically inclined. Which is really cool. Well, Alex, you just went nuts and beat the shit out of somebody in front of your brother. So, how are you feeling right now? Well, at least the music will be great. So I think I might take it off of streamer mode, but I'm also low-key afraid my video might get muted, and that would suck. But I also really want to hear her sing, so decisions, decisions. Okay. Um... Cause like I feel like. I don't think Twitch would, like, give me a ban for, like, something that's literally in the game. But I could also definitely see it happening. Because, you know, Twitch. Um... No, 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 no. I actually really, really love Alex's look. It's great. The glasses, the cut, the nose ring, the earrings in general. It's fucking great. Like, I am 100% here for her style. Surprises are great though. Sometimes. Usually. Being here is too good to be true. I'm not gonna let anything mess it up. I feel like there's no way to not let it get messed up though. Because there's always going to be angry go people. And set things right with Gabe. Mm. Okay, two downstairs. But yeah, there's always going to be angry people. There's always going to be people that are upset. There's probably going to always be people that are a little bit too hot to handle. So, like, there's no way to get around it. Especially if those emotions are always going to affect her. Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. Bro. But I feel like you should get, like, definitely way to go talk about that. Alex, you made it. Charlotte, right? I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Ooh, I love Dad? that necklace. I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. 
It's fine. I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing. Now you just go with him. That's the dad look right there. Alex, I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Now there goes my bartender and my backup bartender. Did he really not want to let him go because, you know, no bartender? That's funny as shit. I love that. It's a falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So, what's it doing today? Uh, falling or rising? Falling. <laughs> falling pretty damn hard. Yeah. I mean, I guess. But it's amazing to see. How's this conversation gonna go, guys? I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. Cooler than Gabe, but he's a great kid. So. Personally, I think he's a great kid, even if he wants to go into some creepy-ass minds. I know literally nothing about kids, but he seems like one of the good ones. I appreciate that. He's my favorite person. <laughs> By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. I hope he won't be mad at me. You did the right thing. Oh no, he's gonna be mad. Beef pie special. Watch the gravy. Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my watch. Right. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival, and they have to be done tonight. Sorry I couldn't talk longer. That's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. Well, I'm damn. Forward to getting to know you. I mean, yeah. left alone on my first night? Hey. How unfortunate. Bye. Thanks for supper. Yep. Oof. And dude's over there looking like a goddamn sad puppy. Okay, there's stuff. So I'm short staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years' experience as a server? Am I getting recruited? Uh, really? Really? Am I first day? Go with Gabe's story or come clean. Go with Gabe's story. Maybe not as long as that. But yeah. I've done lots of things. You want to work a shift? See if you might like it here? Sure. All right. So, we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Steph over here. This is not gonna There's go well. in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. Alright? Got it. This is not gonna go well at all. Really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Let's, you know, fuck Let's everything up. For now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. This isn't gonna go well. Check on. Can I get you two anything? Miss Chen, here at last to relieve our suspense. This dude looks like Santa Claus. Hi. Uh, I am Reginald McAllister, the third, ducky to friends, former entrepreneur, okay, now retired. And this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that, uh, that we all knew. You were coming. Yes. Gabe is generous with uh, Sir, his friendship and I don't need all that information. I just need your food. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from DC six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? Kinda bizarre, kinda perfect. It's bizarre, but I've been here one day and I've already hit my hug quota for the year. <laughs> She's funny. I wasn't Diana joking, is though. A geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. 
cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink, Jed will know what to do. Okay, All thank right, you for I'll that go order. Put that order in. Thanks. Speak. Hey, Jed. Yeah. I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Okay. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, One cheeseburger with mushrooms. I'm pretty sure that was not the order. Uh huh. And? Uh. Shit. Pie with fries? Pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual? Yeah, he did. Yup. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, Am I gonna have to go searching for whiskey? Seriously? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for him. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with him. I might have some idea. He's okay. usually in here. Right I'm an errand now. girl too. Okay. Probably arriving soon. There That's... must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. That's insane. That I am expected to be an errand girl. Just drink some regular whiskey like the rest of us, Leons, and go about your day, sir. Okay. Um, All right. Let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Whiskey. Like, I feel like I would have noticed whiskey, though. Like. But I feel like it... Wasn't in an obvious space. Oh. Is it up there? Nope. Or of course not. Nothing. Not in the most obvious spot, because why? Search the cabinet. Ooh. Now I know where the ramen is. No whiskey though. Well damn. Um not in the fridge, which is what I expected. Um, there's more liquor over here to search through. This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. Really? Not even the thing that says foosball champion? Because I would probably like literally just take that label off and be like, huh. But whatever. Okay. Um. What the hell? I guess I have no choice but to look for that guy. Something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Shit. Now Mac's scared. He should be scared. I want him scared. Don't be a fucking bitch. He won't make me lose control. That's perfectly good. I want to talk to you. But what do you want? What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. <laughs> Not from me. What's your point? 
Where are you going with this? Because well, he's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I don't think it helps. It doesn't help to recap. Details, you know? Oh my god, bro. Are you asking me to cover for your ass? You want me to lie. So you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No. No, just like let me handle it. No. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. Why the fuck would I help you out, dude? You tried to fuck up years. my sibling. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. No. Please. Help me out. You're a douchebag. No. Shit. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god. Look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? She did not want to fucking talk to him. Why do you give a shit? Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. The fact that she doesn't even want to try to I talk it out. Location or we're done. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you. Okay, so what Why is the sob story he's gonna tell? Behind my back. Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. <laughs> I, I feel like she's not gonna believe that at all. Okay. Um. Not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. Is she really gonna believe oh, that? God. Were you there too? Call that shit out. Yeah, no. Call out his bullshit. Call out his bullshit. Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley. Listen. What happened Bro. to Max's face? I did that. Well, good. It sounds like he deserved it. Honesty for the Thanks win. You're telling me the truth, Alex. It's always better to be honest. Wait, are you? Are we okay? Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we still together? What do you? That's think? a dumb you fucking, fucking question, idiot. dude. No. Alex Chen? Uh... Assaulting Mac Cloud on your first day here, huh? Jason Pike, Deputy Sheriff. Are you serious? I'm gonna take you in for questioning. What about, yeah, no, what about Mac? Mac assaulted Gabe. He's the one you want. <laughs> your face. <laughs> your face oh jeez <laughs> no Bro. i'm only kidding uh, nobody's in trouble here I... what kind of fucking prank is that the fuck gabe and i just like to prank each other that is a bullshit prank no <laughs> no no I've no 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 never been pranked by a cop before <laughs> you definitely got me <laughs> thanks for being a good sport can i buy you a drink um maybe i'm working right now well I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? That's a what the fuck moment, but okay. But that is the guy I wanted to talk to. So, I think that's what I wanted to talk to. Um, Glad you could fill in today. Speak to Pike. Ducky's whiskey. Were you hanging out with Ducky and Gabe last night? Who told? 
So, Ducky apparently lost his favorite whiskey. Possibly upstairs? Oh, no. You remember seeing him with it? It probably is a thing that says Spoo's wall on it, here. doesn't it? Oh, but you know what? You should check Gabe's wall of shame. Might have some incriminating evidence. Bro. <laughs> okay, thanks. I will. Okay, back to work. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Uh, now to go over to check on Steph. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though if you want to chat. What are you working on? Is that record store inventory? No, it's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? Who doesn't know what a LARP is? Remind me, or of course, uh, remind me. I've heard the term before. Live action role play. It's like a tabletop role playing game, but acted out in real life. Costumes, foam weapons, theme Fun shit. spells. It's great. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> no, that sounds like a lot of Would fun. Would you ever want to join us sometime? Uh, I'd give it a try or not much of an actor. Probably I'd give it a try. Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. Um, get back to work. I should get back to work. Okay. I've done what Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs Go back to the wall of shame. Where the fuck is it? Look at it. This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. Okay, so go to the couch. Go upstairs. Like, but how the fuck did I miss it if it is by the couch? Um, I'm really happy for you, Gabe. Oh, search the couch now. Um, ha! Got it. Upstairs in Gabe's couch? Really? <laughs> Must have been a night. Many thanks, Alex. Uh, my pleasure. My pleasure, Ducky. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Bro. Allow me. Is he trying to make me do a shot? To Miss Alex Chen. A most tenacious detective. I guess we're doing shots. Cheers. Hard pass. <laughs> Her face says it all. That shit must I've be disgusting. What asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. All right, speak to Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Uh, I think so. So let's explore some Actually, more. Actually, not yet. Apparently, I can explore more, so why not? Let's take a drink with Pike. Back again. Ready for that drink? I'm ready to take you up on that drink. All right. Wait, hey, Jed, can we get uh? <laughs> Bro is ready. Hey. And keep it quick. She's on the clock. <laughs> Damn. Okay. 
You know, your brother's been talking about you getting here for months. I'm starting to get the sense. I even remember exactly the day he found your number. He was telling everybody in this place. I feel like that is really yeah. sweet, though. Yeah. Pretty heartwarming stuff. Like, the story well, is cute. Get back to work. Later, Alex. Alright, um... Speak to them again. Uh, can I talk to anybody else? Can I mess with anything else? Oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. Radical acceptance. Okay. We had a fraternity. Maybe you'll see a circus one day. Once I'm better with crowds. To the plan. Damn. Jack Henry shot at William Porter for four aces and paid with his life. Okay. Guess these were for mining. Restaurant review. Unusually personable staff. Nicely done, big bro. Is there anything this woman can't best do? Best burgers in town. Coupons for weed? Bro. Time to be alive. I'm gonna roast some gold steam. Interesting. What the hell is this? See, Harmon must be Charlotte. This, this is looks really cool. cool. Okay. Um. That looks interesting. Okay, I think I'm done. Yes. Are you done now? Yes. Okay, finish. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. The boys are back in town. Speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. Well, you don't have a black eye. For you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Oof. That we need okay. to talk though. I think that's enough for today. Like why so serious? You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. He is already straight up hiring her. Waiting. You better go upstairs. Alright. Um we'll see time you tomorrow. to go upstairs. Okay. Time to talk to Gabe. The walk of shame. I bet the town looks really pretty from the roof, though. And I'm right, this looks fucking really pretty. have this nice hard talk how's your jaw or the silent treatment how's your jaw how's your jaw bro are you really gonna give me the silent treatment though the pain bag dude look Gabe I'm really sorry. I... I feel her. I'm like, uh, what the fuck are you doing, dude? What? I. Hidden cooler. Did you rehearse that? Like, bro, um... Yeah, did you rehearse that? Did you rehearse that move? No. Yes, you did. You're lying. Only in my mind. Oh, okay. So, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Thank you. I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? 
Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Max not fine, but now that we're talking about it. Guess I never realized. That I'm a crazy person, that I can kick your ass. Uh that I'm a crazy person. That I'm a crazy person? No, come on. Whatever, you think I'm I never crazy. Realized what your life must have been like. I'm on your own. It was fine. That's a bullshit answer and you know it. Mac and you hit me? I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Well, yeah. I fought a lot. Didn't you go to juvie? Um, I fought a lot. Kids in foster care fight a lot. I learned how to defend myself. Which is sad, actually. I'd say. But I'm also like, did the brother not have that experience or not? I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. So yeah, bro, I have like these empathy powers and like, oh, I feel what other people feel. Right now, and yeah, like, so with Mac. who's going to say that though? Uh, tell them about your past. Tell them about your power. Um... You know what? Tell him about the power. He's really gonna think you're crazy then. Confirm. Welcome to Crazy Town. One way ticket. This should be interesting. There's something off. Off about me. I know what other people are feeling. I can see these auras around them. And if they feel strongly enough, if they're angry or sad or afraid. I'm curious how her I brother is going to take this. I hope he believes her, but I don't think he will. And this has happened for a long time. He's not immediately saying, bitch, you're like crazy. Matt, I felt all that anger like it was my own. I think it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. It's more than that. He wasn't just angry at you. He's angry at himself. Oh, no, he's definitely lost his girlfriend. He thinks he's going to lose Riley. Did Riley tell you that? Uh, no, I just feel it. Dude, when? Uh, no, I just feel it. No. No one told me that. I just... feel it. Be a good big brother. Just take it. Don't sure, discredit it. You know. It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds or stress or trauma or whatever. It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? Doesn't work like that. Or you need more beer. Doesn't work like that. It doesn't work like that. It's only when you feel really strong emotions. Oh. I guess you could tell him when he felt uh, when he first got there, me. though. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. Going and start that hurt. Okay. I guess I am. Dude, you have superpowers. 
He just accepted that really quickly. Are you fucking with me? More like a super curse. Um, <laughs> are you fucking with me? I feel like that is the only correct response. You're fucking with me, right? I'm serious. Did you listen to anything I just said? This is terrible. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... No, super curse. I have curse. no idea what's going on with people half the time. I, I, Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there. I mean, that's, that's really special. Oh, shit. He deserves the big fucking brother of the year award. Shit. Special. Special. It's really damn. Okay. All this. Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? But it doesn't matter what's going on. I'm here for you. Like I'm getting the warm and fuzzies over here. Holy that. shit. Fuck. I feel like something's gonna happen to him, and I'm gonna be really sad. <laughs> like, I don't like this. I don't feel okay. I'm not here for this. Like, I think he is gonna die now, because he is too fucking wholesome for this. So, and usually when people are too good slash, like, nice, bad things happen. Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. Surprise? Well, what do you think? I love it. I'm rusty. Uh, I fucking love it. I love it. Oh, fuck, I'm tired. Thank you so much. Of course. It's like almost 3 a.m. Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude. What's up? Hey. Is Ethan up here? No. He was heading home. Oh, fuck. He was. The but... brat probably went to the mines mm -hmm. where they're about to blow some shit up. You don't think. Of course he did. The kid is at maybe. the mines. Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now. Let's go. Damn kids. Let's see. But like you would think like this kid would probably see, you know, the posters maybe of them saying, hey yeah, we're about to blow some shit up. You guys should probably stay away too. Why the fuck would you want to go there? That looks like Ethan? a place you get murdered. The Ethan. hell? No. Honey, no. Fuck that shit. Come on, pick up, pick up. You can't pay me to go there. And go through that tiny asshole? Fuck that. Nope, 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 nope. Alex. There's no way. Okay. Wow. It's been a while since I was up here. Why don't you come here? How worried should we be? Um. Yeah, how worried? Should I be. I don't know. Freaking out. Freaking Hell yeah, out we right should be now? freaking out. In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Yeah, no, we're gonna freak out. Any luck? We'll touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find him. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey, you good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. She's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. Plus side, though, they were able to delay the blast. 
That's good. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from dad? If we'd done anything like this? That'll be an ass whooping waiting to happen. We're gonna find him. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, thanks again for your help. Could have been a lot worse if you hadn't kept me in the loop. Of course. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of evil. Okay. Sure. Um, I can do that. How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? The front door, private property, I guess. Um, okay. something tells me those two weren't the best match. So I know he didn't just go in through the front oh. door. Or... A murder barn. Safety posters. Maybe Julie McNamara doesn't need your approval. Huh. You don't realize until you're up close. But mining equipment is super murdery. Like the kid told you kind of about how he was gonna until have. after we found Ethan. of cave-in. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. You know, who would want to go in there? Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. Are you serious? Same logo. Did this Ethan kid base his comic on this place? Okay. This kid's okay. entire. If the wall is an illusion, comic is based off of this. Obvious. Bruh. Maybe we should notice anything. No, that's shit. actually really cro clever. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds like the mind. Holy shit. Does it show where he went? That's great. Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. There. The silo. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can Holy find shit. A way in. Let's take a look then. Because I'm also like, how did the kid get it, Mo? Okay. Ethan based his comic on this place. Maybe I should compare his drawings with other stuff in the area. No dice. I need to find something like that dead guy Thanor finds. So if the zombie is here, okay. then... If Ethan really followed the path in his comic, finding him just became a lot more doable. Bet. Did Ethan? Oh man. 
Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I think there's like a side door back there? I don't know. I guess there might be. Give me a hand. I guess we're gonna find out. I don't know, how the fuck did this kid find this? You figured that out from a comic book. That's all I wanna know. How? Like, how the hell did this kid move that? Okay, this place is too creepy. Ethan must have come through here. How did he get out? Okay. Um... Have I got some good news for you? Uh, what? Kinda wanna push all the buttons. Also, right? kinda scared to push any of the buttons. Perhaps I can try around. Ethan must have gone upstairs. Okay. Pretty sure Ethan climbed these stairs. Maybe? Maybe. So why would he cover up everything? like an hour ago. Right though? Uh... Not in the comic. Okay. The Put silo. The We're getting close. I think that's in the comic at all. Like, how the fuck did this kid do this? Oh. Yeah. This kid is insane. The jump from here to the conveyor belt? Oof. I think I'll find another way through. Yeah, okay. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Yikes. Yeah, that kid is... Maybe there's some way to open the door. Quite, uh, adventurous. Because there is no way on Earth. Uh, compare. Wasn't in the comic. Okay, I'll stay out. But not because you told me to. Let's see. Where the fuck am I going? Okay. Um. Maybe it's full of Twinkies. Those never go bad, right? This is insane wasn't in the comic. A dead crow, okay. That's rather unfortunate. Is someone living here? Okay. Thanks 
Thanks for nothing, giant yellow button. Brian uh, seems like he knows what he's doing. Glad he's here. This thing has seen better days. I wonder how you open this thing. Is there a button around somewhere? Let's try again. Personally, I'd rather just jump. Nope. Thanor doesn't battle any bed bugs. Ugh. Worse than sleeping on the ground. So back upstairs, I go, I guess. There has to be a kind of want to push all the buttons. Also, I'm kind of scared to push any of the buttons. I'm 100% sure that if I picked up the receiver, there'd be like a demon voice on the other end. Okay, so back up here. Like, holy shit. Am I really this dumb? Apparently. Heads up. Okay. That worked. We figured out the door. Yeah. Turns out you gotta open it. Who knew? Okay. Back down the stairs. Dead bugs. Okay, and leave. What took you so long? You never forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. Wow. Okay. He was doing illegal things. Where to next, Alex? Fun. looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. We can just... Is he going to some hideout? In... Are you there. serious? That's where he's heading. To That's some the ravine. cabin Shit. in the woods? Let's go! Are you fucking serious, kid? What the hell? I can't. Why? It's not that fucking serious. Go camping with your mama or something. We close? I think so. Ethan! Like, this kid did not think this through. Ethan! Got us trapezing through the goddamn forest. Shit. I see purple. I bet this brat's afraid. Oh! That's fucking great. Hold 
Thin? Great. You okay? And I bet this bitch is about to freak out. Don't worry, we're gonna get you. Cause he here. is uber scared. Just hang on. Oh god. I feel like one of them is gonna die. Oh my gosh. No. His fear is so strong. If I get near it. I don't like this. It's no good. We're too heavy. This is no bueno. Shit. What about me? Oh, fuck. Are you sure? This isn't gonna go well. Like at all. Remember how I taught you how to anchor a belay? Also, show me. Okay. This is gonna go great. Okay. She is not okay. Does it matter? I'm okay? No. Uh, does it matter? Doesn't really feel like that's relevant right now, to be honest. It's relevant to me. Okay, well, I'll let you know when I figure it out. I'm gonna hold you to that. Bro. I'm trying to figure out if he's, like, actually concerned or if he's into no. his best friend's you little sister. I'm gonna tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. He'll use that stump as a fulcrum. The feed rope, your direction. Huh. Hello? I feel like that's just means awesome. both of them are gonna go careening off the side of a fucking cliff. Remember, slow is steady. Steady's fast. Piece of cake. I feel like their best option is to try to get him to calm down. And then she could just do it no problem, though. Like. Don't worry about, like, just gonna go get him. Just be like, bro, chill, I got you. Calm the fuck down. Oh, fuck. I actually have to... Okay. Not without you. I need anyway, kid. This is all your fault, so... You're coming with me. Hey, Ethan. I'm here to help, okay? No! Get away! What the fuck do you mean, get away, bro? Like he'd be fine if he would calm, calm down. down. Can you breathe for me? I should never have come out here. Yes, you I'm were very so stupid. stupid. Now, kid, okay, calm, calm the fuck down. Focus. Talk to me. You wanna tell me how you got out here? I was trying to cross to the other side. The log fell. Gabe is our anchor. I've got a really good balance. Gabe's got us. We're not gonna fall. He's got the other end of the rope. No, I can't move if I move. You're not gonna fall, buddy. It doesn't matter. He's not making any sense. I need him to calm okay. down. We can't stay here, Ethan. We have to. It'll see me. If I move, it'll see me. What's what? gonna see you? What the fuck? Okay. I can't help him if I don't understand what he's afraid of. Okay, the so... only way to understand 
is to feel Bro, this is not gonna go well. Oh, fuck. I can't believe this is happening. Okay. So actually let it in. I can do this. I can do this. <laughs> what the fuck? Is it like the boogeyman or some shit that kids are afraid of? More importantly, is there gonna be like some jump scare bullshit? Okay, what is this? Okay, this is kinda cool. What the fuck is that? I thought I could have the what the fuck is that? Those look like actual fucking claw marks. He's not afraid of the fall. What the fuck made those claw marks? Like a giant fucking cat. Hey, I see it too, Ethan. Monster? I see it too. And I'm just as scared as you are. Um, that's weird, but okay. Ethan, we're safe. You know why? That thing can't see us. It can't see me. Bangle vanishing. Go with the story. Oh, some stories are true. Like monsters. So, you're gonna hold my hand, alright? As long as you're touching me, you're safe. Now, what if he's gonna believe me? Alright, come on, Kate. Hurry up. Oh my god, kid. Come on. Not over yet. And now we actually have to go the fuck over. Okay. One step at a time. And there's an actual fucking monster there, apparently. I literally have to do this. I'm still really scared. Okay, I, I I know you're scared. Me too, yeah. kid. Me too. One step at a time. Do this. One step at a time. Okay. Just keep swimming, kid. Do you think the log will break? Bro, I got you. The fact that he keeps asking like questions like that though, kid, like, oh my gosh. Okay, come on. Alright. Holy shit. Like it wasn't even this bad getting across the first time, but going like step by step with this kid like this sucks. Come on. Holy shit. Ah, fuck, 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 no! Okay. No! Okay, look up. 
Come on, we're almost there, motherfucker. We are almost there. Get your fucking ass across this goddamn log. I'm upset because it probably won't even let me just fucking toss this kid. I feel like after this, you can't even like just whip this kid's ass for that. But like, this kid needs an ass whipping. So it wouldn't even be in that position if it wasn't for his like bad idea. Like, holy fuck. And now there's a siren. Okay. That doesn't sound good. It sounds like a fucking air raid. Oh! The explosions they, you know, weren't supposed to be doing. Oh god! I fucking knew it! brother was gonna die. Oh my god. Holy fuck. Oh my god. Bro. Dude would probably is dead on impact from that rock, but like, fuck. Um, okay. That was fucked up. Fuck that kid. Um, I'm gonna end the stream there, cause fuck. Thank you guys for watching, I appreciate you all. Um. Everybody that checked out the stream, you guys are the fucking best. I love you guys. Um, yeah. Holy fuck.